Well, here we are again. Today I'm building a glass bunker for my family. There's supposed to be a Mikey Tsunami tonight. What? Mikey Tsunami? That sounds really scary. Yeah, look at the screen. I really hope that this is some kind of joke and that it will end one day. Because we are a family. Why joke like that? JJ, have you forgotten that we have a child? And what do you want to show me for the video? Come on, show me. Okay, then watch carefully. You've never seen this before. So remember, this may be the last video we watch. I take it that now you won't say that this is some kind of joke? So go and tell these villagers who are no longer there. They will definitely listen to you carefully. Turn it off. I can't watch these villagers suffer anymore. I feel sorry for them. JJ, I believe you. I was wrong. So let's build a bunker as soon as possible and hide from everyone. Because I don't want to die today. Don't be afraid. I will do everything in my power to save you. And no one will get hurt today. You must believe in it. I hope that everything will be fine. The main thing is not to disturb me. Otherwise, I will be nervous. And then obviously no one will like it. The main thing is that you will do something useful. Because I am busy building a bunker. And we will have a glass and obsidian one. Do you understand me? Do you really think that a glass bunker is a good idea? It seems to me that there will be no sense from your bunker. So let's do something really cool. Do you understand me? And I don't understand at all how this is even possible. How can Mikey turn into a tsunami? But I hope for you. So let's build a bunker, even though it's made of glass, but made by your hands. So let's build faster. You're thinking too much. It's unnecessary. So let's get this over with. We'll do our best to survive. And in general, it's not so cool. Of course you help me, but that's not enough. It's a pity that Mikey is not with me. We would definitely build anything with him, but now I have to deal with these troubles alone. But, and I do not know what happened to Mikey. I was surprised when I saw this video. I see that you have almost completed it, but I think that this will not be enough. It is not too safe. And anyway, why do we have to escape from Mikey Tsunami? It's your friend. Why should he attack us? So, let's not be indignant. You better do something interesting. You can only be indignant. So let's do it as quickly as possible. I'll just do everything I wanted and we'll be done with it. You have to understand that, okay? And don't ask me these questions. I don't fully understand what's going on here. And don't distract me because I'm already starting to worry about myself and for you. So just do what you have to do, okay? Hey, I'm actually a girl and our child is still small. So come on, do something useful before we leave you. And I hope that sooner or later you will understand this and will not ask these questions and tell us what to do. Do you understand me or not? I no longer want to live with you. You are kind of aggressive. So it's time for us to do something interesting. And in general, it seems to me that this, you're kidding me. And if that's the case, then let's get this over with. Do you understand me? Come on. You do less nonsense and just dig a bunker. And I hope that at least you are capable of it. So, the main thing is not to give up. Everything should work out for us. So let's listen to me. And everything will be fine with us. Okay? And when we survive, then don't thank me. Because I already know that you survived only because of me. It's a pity that you deny it. But... As I see it, you are better at digging than thinking. So don't stop. This is where we will live. I hope that you understand this. Wait, what are you doing? Why do you need traps? Why did you even plan this? I don't like this anymore. We were just building a bunker, but this is something superfluous. And I hope that you also understand this, but it doesn't matter. Okay, I agree that sometimes you do something useful, but it's not always. And anyway, why are you constantly pestering me with these questions? I don't fully understand. What have we done to you? Personally, I'm already tired of you and all your jokes. These traps are absolutely necessary for us. And I hope that you understand this because Mikey will suddenly sneak in here. And I did it because we don't know what to expect from him. So we have to be ready for anything. So don't let me down until I've done something terrible for someone. So let's help me. Otherwise, I will then experience a tsunami outside. And I think that you will not like it at all. So forget about it. 
Do you understand me or not? Let me just dig, and you do what you want, because I'm already tired of you, and I don't want to hear this nonsense from you. I'm already tired of this. It would be better if this tsunami started as soon as possible. I think it will be at least a little more fun with Mikey. But, you'll find a way to ruin everything anyway. And that's all because you're very boring and necessary. But I don't blame you for that. The main thing is, don't forget about your family. And build a bunker for us and everything else. Otherwise we'll leave you. And you'll be left alone at all. Just look at the trap I've come up with. You've never even dreamed of it. So don't envy me. I'm a master at it. But if you really want a tsunami and Mikey, then come on. You can leave here and hope that you don't die right away. So let's either help me as soon as possible or get out of here and don't ask me unnecessary questions. I really hope for you. You don't seem to have realized said yet that this bunker is the only chance to survive. And in general, it's not as much fun as you think. Why are you being so rude to me? I'm helping you. If it wasn't for me, then you wouldn't have succeeded. So let's better not quarrel with you. We're both in this deplorable situation, and we both have to do everything possible to make our child survive. So let's get this over with. I hope you did everything right, and the ceiling doesn't collapse on our heads, because I don't know what to think about it anymore. I want everything to be the same as before. I don't like this at all. And if Mikey were here, I'd like to ask him a couple of questions. And the main question is, Mikey, how did you turn into a tsunami? Guys, I have good news for you. We have finished the construction of the bunker, so now you don't have to worry about it. But while we still have time, we have to go to the village and buy something there, or find something that we can survive. And I hope that everything will be fine with us. The main thing is that you do not stray far from me, so that I do not do anything wrong, and you will not get lost if the tsunami starts. But first we need armor, in case we have to fight him, and we have to be ready for that. Do you understand me or not? So, I think my family needs armor too, so that everything would be fine with them, and they wouldn't worry. Although you remembered about us for the first time, and thank you for that, we have never had a reservation yet. Um, and what is it? Why didn't you take anything from him? Is this some kind of deception or what happened at all? JJ, what are you up to and where are you going? Explain to me what happened, because I'm already starting to worry about you and our family. What's not clear here? In order for a villager to make armor, he needs iron. So let's dig faster. And I hope that you will do it, because we don't have much time. So come on, don't stop. No one will wait for you. The main thing is not to give up, because in order for us to survive, everyone must make an effort to do so. I hope you don't have any unnecessary questions, so let's just repeat after me. And nothing more is required of you, okay? Okay, I get it. Just don't yell at us. We don't deserve it. And anyway, it seems to me that you've gone crazy. So please, let's get this over with and move on. This is the hardest thing, and I hope you understand it too, and sooner or later you'll get over it. So, let's make armor already. Or, do you want to finish without anything? So, but I didn't understand a little why we needed armor if we were building a bunker with traps. Will you explain to me or not? Well, I understand you've come up with some nonsense again, and now you're imposing your opinion on everyone. Mikey, don't distract me. I'm busy here with our future armor, and I hope that you understand me and won't do any more nonsense. So let's get this over with as soon as possible. And anyway, how do you like it? So, you asked me questions there, so I'm going to answer this now. But I'm not sure if you like it or not. But the main thing is, don't give up. We need armor if the bunker doesn't help us. And then, we'll fight this tsunami. And in general. So there's a better chance of survival, how do you understand me? So what? And how long do we have to stand here now? Do you think it's safe at all? And when will it end? I hope that everything will end well with us. And in general, do you understand what you are doing? And how it will all end if you don't come to your senses? So what? You gave this villager all your resources. And now what? How long do we have to wait? Or what are you talking about now? JJ, don't you think that you were deceived? 
because you gave him everything, and he just left, so let's end this. I hope that everything is fine with Mickey, and what we saw is some kind of deception or video editing. I'm so tired of you. I knew I should have locked you in the bunker because I don't understand what I'm doing because of you anymore. Okay, let me explain to you. We're waiting for the armor to be ready, and then we'll just take it away. And no one cheated on me. Do you understand? So if you want to survive, Nick, then just go to your bunker. And you can hope that everything will be fine with you. You, do you understand me or not? But now we will have the coolest armor. So let's get this over with. I will definitely survive now and no one will be able to kill me. Even this tsunami. Why are you always talking to me like that? I just want to be aware of all our plans. And you just mock me all the time. And I hope that you will now take this armor and we will leave here and finally forget about this day. But why is nothing happening at all? This is how it should be. Or why did we stay here at all and what are we waiting for? Please in this, just admit that this is a prank and that you are mocking me. And then we will forget everything. Do you understand me or not? No, this is not a prank. And soon you will see for yourself. So you are happy early. And the most interesting will be ahead. Okay, now this villager will give us armor and then we will definitely be safe. So let's get this over with. Of course I'm already tired of you and this whole situation, but something tells me that Mikey's tsunami will be here soon, and that's why we have to be ready. By this, do you understand me? So we put on the armor and go to the bunker. It seems that I heard something, so we should be safe. Okay, let's do it already. But even though you're angry, but thank you for that. I like diamond armor. And anyway, why did he give you the diamond armor? We were digging iron for him. Is this some kind of magic or some kind of deception? I'm tired of all this. So let's just do something in this bunker so that we don't accidentally go crazy here. And what are we going to do here? Did you come up with something? Or should I tell you something again? Do you understand me? Well, I do not know. So let's do something interesting. For example, I would build something else. So let's not waste any time, and I hope that everything will be fine. Do you understand me or not? Oh my god! JJ, the tsunami has started, and everything is exactly as it was on the video. I'm very scared. I definitely didn't expect this. And what should we do about it? Please tell me that you know what to do, because I don't want anything anymore. And this bunker will be able to withstand this tsunami? Oh my god! Do you even see how many of them there are? And they're all looking at us, Gog. And who are they? To be honest, I'm afraid of that too. So I think we'll need to improve our bunker so that nothing bad happens to us. It's kind of terrible. I'm already starting to get nervous. And I hope it's just some clones. But is there a real Mikey among them? I'm here. But you'll never find me. Because I have a whole army, egg, so let's forget about it. You've already lost. And I have already got into your bunker, so you are doomed to defeat and death. Which means that everything you did today was in vain. But don't worry, I'll turn you into a tsunami too. You'll like it. The main thing is don't worry. I'll destroy you quickly and I'll end it. No, we're not giving up, so don't even think about it. But I knew you were involved in this. But you shouldn't have decided to attack us because we are ready. We knew in advance about you and about this tsunami. So let's give up while you have the opportunity, because then there will be no such opportunity anymore. And anyway, what's going on here? Are these clones going to end? Or is this some kind of joke? I'm tired of fighting them already. And I hope that this will end as soon as possible. How funny you are. I don't even know how to react to your words because everything you do is really meaningless. So just don't tell me anything. I know exactly what I need to do so that you become the same as us. Do you understand me? Why do you keep running away? Do you really think you can destroy me or leave? You're just wasting my time. And where did you run to anyway? Why did you eat the cake? And what are you doing? JJ, we have already defeated many. So let's destroy them all as soon as possible. And I hope that everyone is ready for this. You and I have to find the main one, the real Mikey. And then we can stop this tsunami. So let's get this over with as soon as possible. 
because I'm already hungry. Do you hear me? Of course I can hear you, and we'll find the real Mikey. So let's do our best already. They'll run out sooner or later. So let's just get this over with, and then everything will be fine with us. And so, Mikey, if I were you, I'd give up. You've already lost, and you won't succeed. So it's better if you give up yourself, than we destroy you. Mikey, you will answer to me for every action you take. Don't even doubt it. I will make sure that it would be so. Therefore, if I were you, I would come to my senses. Because then it'll be too late when I finally get to you and find a way to deal with you. So your time will come too. And don't even think about me forgetting about you or what you did. Okay? How funny you are! It was all a prank! And you believed it, although I thought you would believe it! The main thing is not to worry. You have built a good bunker. I admit that. Okay, then we'll do a prank for Mikey now. So thank you for watching. I'll do it myself, so don't strain yourself.